Hey guys, if you've never had a single sided swing arm on your bike before, you might be wondering how easy it is to maintain your bike. Uh, keep your chain clean, lube it up, and also just maintain the chain health and attention in your chain. You may also be wondering how easy it is to get a bike up onto a stand, onto a paddock stand. Um, so I thought I'd give you a quick review. I just received my RNG elevation uh, stand in the post last week. Here it is here. Uh, so it's made from powder coated tubular steel, it's mandrel bent, it's welded, it's a single piece, there's no assembly required other to insert the pin into the stand. Uh, very happy with the quality of the product, it looks like it's going to uh, be really robust and, and stand up to years of use uh, with no problems at all. When you water your stand uh, for a single sided swing arm, clearly you need to water it for the right side of the bike. On the Triumph, it's the left hand side. So you, I ordered a left hand side stand uh, and you need to make sure that the pin that you order that inserts into the side of that stand is the right diameter for um, the specifications on your swing arm. On the Triumph, it's a 27 and a half millimeter pin. Pop the pin into the stand, circle clip on this side, polyurethane sheath over the other side of the pin and another circle clip holds that sheath in place. Uh, very, very easy to use and very easy to get the bike up once you've got the, the pin in the stand. All you really need to do is put that pin into the side of the swing arm, apply just a little bit of pressure to level the bike out, and then pop it up. Um, obviously, you know, because it is a single sided product, um, there's no stand on the right hand side, so arguably. It's even easier to, uh, for maintenance, you've got full access to that right hand side of that open wheel. Um, I've found it really easy to maintain the chain. Uh, in terms of making sure that your tension is right, you've got a single bolt in the back of the swing arm here which you undo. There's a little lever that comes in your toolkit, you insert that into that side just behind the chain and you just tension up your chain that way, making sure that your slack's right. Uh, really easy, probably easier than a um, dual-sided swing arm because you don't have to worry about getting that adjustment on both sides of the swing arm perfect. Uh, that problem's pretty much gone. So that's it. That's the product and that's the process to get it off the stand. Roll the bike back down, take the pressure off to tilt it back onto the side stand. Slide your pin back out and you're good to go. That's the product and that's the review. Thanks for watching.